today topic of discussion is yersinia pestis morphology it is short plum ovoid gram negative bacilli they are rounded cell with convex sides which give them safety pin appearance they are stained with gymsa or methylene blue this is the characteristic of safety pin appearance in yersinia pestis pleomorphism is very common in them and it is surrounded by a slime layer they are non motile non sporing non acid fast bacilli so this one is gram negative bacilli rounded cell with convex side look like safety pin appearance in gymsa or methylene blue pleomorphism is very common non motile non sporing non acid fast bacilli this is all about morphology of yersinia pestis virulence factor first is fraction i it is heat liable protein antigen which inhibit phagocytosis fraction i heat liable protein antigen inhibit phagocytosis second one is w and v antigen they are always produced together they inhibit phagocytosis and intracellular killing of pathogen so second one is w v antigen always produced together inhibit phagocytosis and intracellular killing third one is bacteriocin bacteriocin is also called as pestin i uh, this one will inhibit other stains like yersinia uh, pseudo tuberculosis yersinia enterolytica and e coli so it will inhibit other stains like yersinia pseudo tuberculosis yersinia enterolytica and e coli fourth virulence factor black toxin it is made up of two toxin Uh, endotoxin and murine toxin endotoxin is a lipopolysaccharide this murine uh, toxin active in rats other virulence factor is uh, that ability to synthesis purine these are the virulence factor fraction i uh, wv antigen bacteriocin also called as pestin then plaque toxin then ability to synthesis purine plaque plaque is a disease caused by yersinia pestis the himalaya is the original home of plaque in india there are four pokai of plaque first one is kolar second one is beet latur belt in maharashtra rothru in himachal pradesh and small packet in uttaranchal which are the four foci in india kolar uh, second one is beet latur belt rothru in himachal pradesh small packet in uttaranchal which are the four foci in india there are three form of plaque bubonic pneumonic and septicemic first we will discuss about this bubonic the bacilli enter through filly bite on legs the inquel nodes are involved that's why it is called as fubonic plaque bacilli enter through filly bite on legs the inquel nodes involved that reason only it is called fubonic uh, here the local lymph nodes is affected and the gland get enlarged and the superative and blood stream leads to septicemia sometimes it can occur in hemorrhage into the skin and mucosa disseminated intravascular coagulation is common it can leads to gangrene of skin fingers and penis the mortality has highest 30 to 90 percentage so bacilli enter through filly bite on legs then it affected blood stream so it cause to septicemia gangrene of skin fingers and 
penis mortality 30 to 90 percentage second type pneumonic plague this is sometimes seen during epidemics of bubonic plague rarely it can occur as primary pneumonic plague occur epidemic form this spread as tablet infection name suggest pneumonic lungs involvement expressed through tablet enter lungs leading to hemorrhagic pneumonia and cirrhosis is very predominant here this stage is highly infectious and almost invariably fatal in untreated cases second one is pneumonic plague this one is uh, that epidemic of pubonic plague rarely it can occur as primarily pneumonic plague this one is epidemic form through tablet it will enter it affected lungs then cyanosis is very predominant if not taking treatment it become fatal third one is septicemic plague this is usually terminal event in pubonic or pneumonic plague it can sometimes occur primarily rarely they can be involvement of meningitis uh, there is uh, no human carrier so this one is the terminal event in pubonic and pneumonic plague sometimes occur in primarily rarely involvement of meningitis there is no human carrier actually plague is a zoonotic disease the plague bacilli uh, this one is a natural parasite uh, in rodent infection transmitted among them by rat fleas the rat fleas acquired infection by feeding on the infected rodent laboratory diagnosis um, first one is specimen collection in pubonic plague means uh, the pubos are collected for microscopy in pneumonic plague means we will collected sputum sample septicemic means we will collected blood sample bubonic means pubos pneumonic means sputum septicemic means blood samples then next direct demonstration under that microscopy smear for bubo stained with methylene blue uh, bipolar stained bacilli second one is fluorescent antibody technique which is used to identify the plague bacilli in impression film of tissue by demonstrating fi antigen fraction antigen so direct microscopy first one is a smear for bubo stained with methylene blue here bipolar stained bacilli which shows uh, bipolar stained bacilli second one is fluorescent antibody technique in this one fi antigen fraction uh, i antigen demonstrated culture the culture is made uh, from uh, pubo spleen heart blood and in case of decomposed carcass particularly from the bone marrow uh, next animal inoculation a rats a rat is die of black may carried infected fleas so they should be handled with care they can be destroyed by pouring kerosene oil over the carcass and the carcass tipped in over 3 percentage lysol to destroy ectoparasite first one is culture animal inoculation rat uh, dice of black may carry infected fleas they should be handled um, with a careful way so here destroyed by pouring kerosene oil over the carcass tipped in over three percentage of lysol to destroy ectoparasites next biochemical reaction indole test negative mr test positive vp negative citrus uh, catalase test catalase test positive then uh, bile 
exulin test also positive, oxidase and urease test negative, intol BP test negative, uh, MR catalase then by exulin test, exulin test positive, oxidase and urease negative, it can ferment glucose, maltose, manitol, it producing acid but no gas, whereas lactose and sucrose are not fermented. It can ferment glucose, maltose, mannitol, not in lactose and sucrose. Acid production, no gas production. Next one is serological technique. Antibodies to FI antigen detected by passive agglutination. Fraction I antigen uh, detected by passive agglutination test. Uh, then other serological method including IgG, IgM, uh, immunoglobin G and immunoglobin M, the ELISA test. It is a rapid um, tip stick assay also used. Then molecular method PCR. Uh, with this one is rapid and sensitive method. Next one is prophylaxis and treatment. For prophylaxis method, uh, control of fleas and rodent then vaccines we are using two different type of vaccine killed and live vaccine a live vaccine low no longer used killed vaccine we can use that uh, given subcutaneously three doses totally first to two doses one to three month interval third dose sixth month later we will give then treatment cotrimus azole and uh, tetracycline so cotrima azole then tetracycline is the drugs of choice statement format Thanks for watching.